Have you ever wondered if spontaneous human combustion is real? If a person could suddenly, inexplicably burst into flames? Today we delve into such a mystery, a tale that's as chilling as it is baffling. In the summer of 1951, in the quaint city of St. Petersburg, Florida, an event occurred that left investigators puzzled and the public fascinated. The central figure of our tale is Mary Reeser, a 67-year-old woman who lived alone in her apartment. Mary was, by all accounts, a normal woman living a normal life, until the morning of July 2nd. On that fateful morning Mary's landlady arrived at her door, only to find the doorknob unusually hot to the touch. A sense of unease crept in and she immediately called the police. When the authorities arrived and stepped into the apartment they were met with a sight that was anything but ordinary. In the midst of Mary's otherwise undisturbed living room, they found a pile of ashes. The pile was small, no more than a few pounds, but it was all that remained of Mary Reeser. The woman had been reduced to little more than a pile of ashes, with only a part of her left leg remaining intact. Her skull, inexplicably, had shrunk to the size of a teacup. The rest of the apartment was mostly untouched by the fire. How could a human body burn at such high temperature and leave the surroundings mostly untouched? This was the question that haunted everyone involved in the case. The FBI was called in to investigate. They concluded that Mary's death was caused by what is known as the wick effect, a process where a person's body fat can sustain a fire much like a candle. They theorized that Mary had fallen asleep while smoking and her flammable nightgown had caught fire. But this theory did not satisfy everyone. Skeptics pointed out the lack of extensive burning in the apartment and the inexplicable shrinking of the skull. Moreover, how could a cigarette cause a fire hot enough to reduce a human body to ashes? Other theories began to surface. Some suggested spontaneous human combustion, a phenomenon where a person can burst into flames without any apparent external source of ignition. Others pointed to the possibility of a lightning strike or even arson. Yet none of these theories could fully explain the strange circumstances of Mary Reeser's death. To this day, the case of Mary Reeser continues to intrigue and puzzle people all over the world. It remains a chilling reminder that there are still mysteries in our world that defy explanation. Whether the truth behind Mary's death will ever be uncovered, only time will tell. For now, it remains one of Florida's most perplexing unsolved mysteries.